Psoriasis is a skin disorder driven by the immune system involving a type of white blood cell called a T cell. Normally, T cells help protect the body against infection and disease. In the case of psoriasis, T cells can become so active that they trigger other immune responses, which lead to inflammation and rapid turnover of skin cells. In many cases, there is a family history of psoriasis. Researchers have identified a large number of families affected by psoriasis and identified genes linked to the disease. Genes govern every bodily function, determining the traits passed from parent to child. Of people with psoriasis, 11 to 40 percent of people also develop arthritis, typically between the ages of 20 and 50. Called psoriatic arthritis, this condition causes joint stiffness in the morning along with inflammation and pain in the fingers and spine. Pink scales also appear on the knees, elbows, lower back, and chest. If this condition is left untreated, it can cause permanent damage to the joints. A recent study indicated that people with severe cases of psoriasis are more likely to develop other complications, including depression, obesity, cardiovascular disease, hypertension, diabetes, cancer, and immune-related conditions such as Crohn's disease. Getting rid of psoriasis involves much more than just applying some lotion or taking a pill. That's why doctors say there's no cure, meaning that they're unable to recommend a cream or a pill to cure the problem. But that doesn't mean there isn't a cure. Countless people have gotten rid of their psoriasis over the years by following the three proven steps required to address any psoriasis problem. Are you taking the required steps? Visit the 3 and follow the proven steps of others who have successfully dealt with their psoriasis.